so what's the plan before we uh, dive in? Are we gonna go back to the... I think... To the cannon and kind of actually see what we can there now? That yeah, I think, I think the, the plan is go to yeah. the cannon, and then while we're over there, if we don't lose the ship somehow... <laughs> We, we will probably lose the ship, I don't know. We'll just fall onto Giant's Deep and uh, explore the lab that we only got to see for a tiny moment. My backpack fell off the bed. That was the thud that you might have just heard. Oh, we did. <laughs> Alright, well, time to wake up. Blind let's play. We're, we know we're going to be frustrating people. We know we're doing it right if we're frustrating people. <laughs> oh, it's already on fire. So I discovered the uh, the thing that I was talking about last time, the UI scale. It's apparently uh, the latest update that came out for the game, which was like last week, basically. Uh, changed or added an accessibility feature to make the UI larger for people who need it. Uh, it's just it's on by default. So that's what I kept seeing, and yeah. Oh wait, did I tell you the funny thing out of the? So I was talking to my husband about this, and I'm like, "Oh, it, it's frustrating because uh, FP always roasts a marshmallow before we leave, and it's wasting time." And he literally just turns it back on me and goes, "Yeah, but you, I. Th so now you know how I feel when I'm watching you play Baldur's Gate, and you stop and kiss a star, and every time you leave camp, uh. <laughs> so I'm not allowed to laugh anymore. At your marshmallow. I'm not allowed to complain about the marshmallow anymore." Don't worry, I still am. <laughs> I wonder why I can't get the lock. The lock on isn't locking on. Is it because you were looking at the planet and not... Well, I'm clicking the left stick in. Is... Oh. I don't know either. Is it hold the left stick? I can't remember. No, how. it's the just a, it's a simple stick. click. Well, this thing is like... Maybe if I just, like, wedge the ship in here good enough. It won't go flying out the side. This is the sort of high-quality, uh, ship landing that we've come to expect. Yep. Listen, worst-case scenario, we see what happens if you attempt an orbital re-entry without a spaceship. <laughs> uh, where was the entrance on this place? Sometimes, I think on the back? Uh, one of them was on the outside. I think the one you're looking for is on the back. Uh, yeah, this is a gravity well, so this is probably what we're looking for. Yeah. Alright, I don't remember which uh, room it was, but one of them we could only get from outside, one we could only get from inside. Okay, I'm flying too fast. Uh, that's the broken port probe to place, maybe? Or is this the way I just came in? That's the way I just came in. Excellent. Excellent navigation skills. Uh, I believe that's the one, the broken glass, the, the down path. This one's the... Come on. I don't know. We did. We were in here what, what, like two weeks ago in terms of recording time. Yeah. Okay. This is. It is the stone. The projection. All right. Well, let's see first. All right. Launch module projection stone. What is it showing us that's different? Isn't this just like? Outside, next door? No, it's showing... Well, there goes the quantum moon. Because, <laughs> like, the launch, the launch module isn't the one that we need. It's the tracking module. Yeah, the launch module... Oh, we're... Yeah, this is just... No, yeah, we're looking like at the outside just... one. Yeah, we're yeah, looking at the just looking at... Yeah, this I is think just that's showing room, you like... the hint of how you can get into the launch module. Maybe. Alright, let's see the giant... You can't just one. figure it out. Okay, I can't this use... This is the workshop, I think? No, is I think it's... No, it's different. This is a part we haven't been to. Oh, okay, that must be the last island, then. Yeah, we have not been here. What but there's the... another... Oh, it's up in the air. Right there. Alright. On the floor. 
There was a projection stone on the ground. Yeah, I just couldn't do anything with it. No, I'm just noting it for when we get to that location. Okay. Oh, I have jumped too high. Alright, so let's go back outside and get in the broken one. Because it probably had a, a projection stone there. Alright, this one's open to space. Also, it appears that our ship is, in fact, still just wedged in there properly. Oh, we could have gone in that way easily. Uh, FP okay. is getting better at parking the love of his life. <laughs> <laughs> you and that ship have a special bond now. I can't be without it. It takes me places. All right, let's see. There, okay, yeah, there is a uh, control module. Oh, this would be the other side, though. Yeah, this is the side we just left. Huh. Was there a probe module, though? Because that's the that's the one we need. That's the missing one. Yeah. Is there another one flying around in here? What's on the table? On the table? Oh, you're right, there's another one oh, on the yeah. table. Okay, yeah, here we go. Because this one's missing, we need info about this one. Let's see if we can tell where it went. There's another statue in there. There is. Where is this lightning? Yeah. I don't think we've seen anything like this. We haven't. Well, is this is this... what the probe tracking module was like before it broke off, right? Or is this its current state? No, this is its current it state. Be current. It's current because okay. the other the other one, the launch module uh, projection yeah, showed it was broken. It, it has to be it has to be current because the giant steep stone the, the stone that showed us giant steep was actively in the process of getting violently thrown into the air. Yeah. There's another stone over there, oh. but it's probably a projection for one of these other rooms. Uh, so, where if you, so what happens if you step in there and pull out your, your tracker? I couldn't. You can't while you're in? Okay. Yeah, I tried pulling out the signal scope in the on the giant steep one. Probe tracking module will be the first to know the coordinates of the IA of the universe. No, we knew this. We knew that they had... We think that they had the cannon use too much power. Yeah, that's how it Oh, we, we know that they did. That was... They, they openly admitted it. Yeah. Okay. Well... You see... So... Let's run down the list of places we've been. The only, pla the only place we haven't physically been other than the quantum moon, because we can't get there yet... Interloper. Is the Ash Twin, right? No, Ash. We haven't been Ash Twin. Uh, we, we have, we but have. not really. We have. Like, we've been the... Ash Twin at a time when we can access the stuff that's on Ash Twin. Yeah, yeah we, 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 we've been on the surface of it, but Ash Twin probably isn't going to have that electricity going on. No. So either it's in the quantum moon, somewhere on a planet that we haven't noticed yet, or. Um, what's it called? The the interloper or whatever the, the asteroid. I mean, we've never been to the interloper, so going there makes a lot of sense. I'm trying to bounce my way out of here. It oh, worked. Can't wait for you to damage your ship. It worked. I still I don't understand why I can't click to like autopilot. Well, we're at Giants Deep. Let's just. What is oh that? yeah, because we. Is that the sun? That's the sun. Oh, That's we're being pulled in. We're being pulled in. All right, okay. we're atmosphere. We're, we're already here, so fuck it. Let's go find the fourth island. Is that it? No. No, no, no. we've been to that one. That's where That's, the work yeah, oh, right. That's where the workshop is. That's the workshop. We should go down there and actually swim down and take a look around right. now that we're not on a weird... I 
I just hope it doesn't get thrown anytime soon. Fingers crossed. Eh, it's all... It looks like it's all far enough away. You'll be fine. Okay. Right, so... So last time we were here, we learned that they were building a giant memory hard drive. Oh, right. that's right. The, the gravity here is the really statue. heavy. <laughs> if he tries to find gravity, he does not succeed. <laughs> okay. Kindly step back so he's closest. When pairing the statue, will choose whoever's closest proximity. So you have its eyes have opened. Oh yeah, we read this. This is about the Ash Twin project and how it stores memory. Yeah, but we weren't really able to like take our time and process what was going on here. Yeah. So if the statue had been in the museum, I wonder why it paired with us. Because we weren't the first Parthian to look at it. Right. Oh yeah, we figured that there's three there's three people that are currently in the time loop. And we know three two of them. Because we talked to the guy on Giants Deep and he said that he was also in the loop. So there's a third one that we're not aware of. And my speculation was it's whoever it is is on the the cannon, which is why at the start of every uh, cycle, I might only be able to get up to there while uh, it's, it's flying up in the air. Yeah. Well, Alternately, whoever it is could be on the quantum moon. Because didn't we read all that stuff about there was one? Nomai who is like preparing to make their pilgrimage to the quantum moon, maybe they're still there. Maybe. Maybe they never left. Who knows if the, the quantum moon has normal time. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I can get flung up here without dying. <laughs> Just kidding. I strongly suspect that there isn't anything normal about the quantum moon. Probably I'm not. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, this is the entrance. Okay. I don't know how long it'll take for the cyclone to come back. Oh, wait, no. I think it's coming. I hear wind. Lots of wind. Whoosh. Yeah, that sounds like impending disaster. <laughs> it's fine. Okay, I'm I'm weightless right now, and perfect. Now let's wait for it to splash back down, and we can do some reading. <laughs> All right. Okay, I'm curious. Is sending a being's memories back in time the same as sending the being itself back in time? What? Oh god, no. As an example, if we were to send my memories back in time, is that the same as sending me back in time? Not my physical body, but my essence. I imagine they're two different actions. Wouldn't both actions be effectively the same? Suppose time was being rewritten. I believe this is different than receiving memories of what is, from what is effectively the future. Isn't the end result identical in either case? So, are we not... We're not stuck in a time loop? We're just having our... Well, we are stuck in a time loop, but our memories keep going backwards through the statues? 
Don't get existential on me. Game's already one step ahead of you. Alright, so that looks like that's everything in here. Yeah. Let's go back to the ship. So there's there's one more island out there somewhere. I keep seeing a red flashing. So you know what I'm gonna do? Because I don't think we did this last time. I don't think we looked at the ship log. Or no, we did. We did before we finished up. Okay, so we don't have anything new to report yet. Other than... It looks like the module is underwater. I could see purple electricity outside the viewport. So did the probe tracking, tracking module launch straight down into the planet? So it's here somewhere. So that, oh, sure. that, that must be why we need to get to the core of... Which we know how to do. Of Giant Steve. Because we need it to access oh. the... Uh... <laughs> it's okay, we can go underwater a little. It's just the gravity keeps messing with me. Okay, I think that's the one... This must be the island with Gabro. Yeah, because yeah. it's got the campfire on it. And then there's the, the really big cyclone. I'm still convinced we could go under it and get into it. We could also just try or going above into it. it. Yeah, yeah, or, or above, above it. it. Well, the commenters did say they felt we were being too cautious. <laughs> There's the jellyfish. And that they would not mind seeing us die horribly and not having the episodes being a one-to-one -one loop per episode because we got killed horribly. Alright, well, there's the island. You just gotta go through. Because the middle of a cyclone is the totally right place to build a giant tower. I mean, it is. It's the safest if you're place. A wizard. I mean, it worked for Zelda. It's looking like some Zelda ass tower. I mean, also that's that's genuinely true. The eye, you know, being inside the eye of the hurricane is the only safe place to be. Yeah. I noticed this is actually this tower is actually on like the one of the poles of the planet. You see the little on the side. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. So if we need to come back here, we know how to get back here quickly. Be welcomed in this place. The, this tower shares with all who ask the knowledge make his first quantum oh. journey. Right, because... Oh, oh, okay, um, the, yeah, this is the... They talked that... about it in the Tower of Quantum Knowledge, that you had to go to Giant's Deep to train. Yeah, so this is, the, this is the bit that we're missing to actually get onto the quantum moon, because we have yeah. the other stuff. They trained here. Right. Enter this place without friends. However, these are lessons to learn for yourself. Alright, well, uh, let us know when you're done, FP. We'll, uh, we'll be back. <laughs> okay, so then I'll see... Now, who said you were my friends? Just kidding. No, wow. Right. <laughs> wow. Okay, I don't see any way to go other than down. Doesn't appear to be anything up here either, so... Whee! All right, seek the wandering arch. There it is. Quantum arch. There it it's is. Art. Yeah, it's quantum. Oh. Oh, and go down further. Hello. Quantum stone. My frame rate did not like that. Island shard. Continue to oh, seek God, the arch. This, 
Yeah, probably. Okay, there's something else you can read over there, though. Observing a quantum object. Observing an image of the quantum object. These are the same. So, fire a drone somewhere where he can keep an eye on the arch, and then... You're right. See, this is teaching us how to get to the quantum moon. Yeah, so now, even if we... Yeah, even if it goes out of view, because we can see it through the camera, it... That's good knowledge. And we have the information from the um, quantum the power shirt. that we need to go to the pole of the quantum moon to go to the secret sixth location. I think that is the same shard, yes. Do I need to track this for some... Oh, I can see me! No, I think this There's is the, the new arch room. Again. But it's up there. We need to get it to somewhere we can actually... We need to get it up. Oh, gravity stone. Yeah. Gravity oh, the gravity stone. stone moves, too. Quantum... So we gotta get the gravity stone and the arch on the same... Okay, yeah, so just take a picture of the arch so that it can't move. Or, I... you know, pick one. Right, to get a picture... It's no, I, I need to view the, um, the stone... Because as soon as the stone exited my view, as I walked up the thing, it just it stopped. It dropped me. So well, I that's what I'm saying, right? Like, yeah, pick, pick observe one. the stone, and then just kind of look around until the arch shows up behind me. It might not be able to spawn in if you're standing where it would spawn in. Yeah, so. that's what I'm saying. Just kind of look around until the like go back down. Oh, we know okay, yeah, back okay, down yeah, 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 yeah. And then just keep looking up and down. <laughs> Once you get away from the wall. I can't. The wall is stuck. The wall is too powerful. Okay, let's try this again. Yeah, so just... So, a picture of the stone, and then just kind of look around until they match. The arch and the crystal do not naturally meet. Yeah, which is why you have to force it. Wait, the crystal moved. Oh, I put my thing away. To read. Yeah, you're okay. gonna have to... Yeah, you're gonna oh. have to force this. Or, yeah, yeah, you gotta stop one of them. Yeah. There we go. Uh, you may want to shoot that higher now so that it can't... So it can get both. Yeah. Kind of lock it in place. There you go. Yeah. Oh no, we're already done? Or almost done? Shoot. Just keep just keep going. We now we that we figured end? out this looks like it might be the end. Yeah. Maybe. But now that we've no, it's not. figured out the puzzle, we can do this a lot faster. Next Last time. one, but we made it harder. <laughs> oh, Thanks. No. Yeah, we're gonna die before we finish this, but we have this information and we can head right back here. Oh, man, how do we get up this so, wall? <laughs> There's you're only gonna have to lock one. Of, yeah, you're gonna have to lock one of them in place and then zigzag them. Come on, game. Let me up this wall. Oh, it's it's the other one's in the way? Nah, that's... <laughs> I'm sorry, this isn't funny. Except it is. It is. It's too late. And here it comes. One, two, and I took it away. No. No time. Okay, we'll come back here as soon as, we're, as, soon as this is done. Well, northern side... North Pole of the planet, um, in the largest cyclone. That's all we can do. I 
think if we dedicate a whole loop to it and don't have to go via the probe or the cannon, then I think we'll be okay. Because we did the cannon and this in one loop. We also, we also wandered around take, the lab. We also had to take some time to figure out the puzzles, and now we know the puzzles. Yeah. We can beeline to where we need to be. 